trying to see how it's going. Yeah. Here we go. So they struck the yes this time. How's it sound? Good? You can be a little closer or a little louder. Okay, I'll probably just try to be a little louder. I don't want to be too loud because I don't want to, like, you know, disturb players, but... Nah, fuck them. Fuck them. The classic. Yep, pretty much. Oh, there's a tailor missed the throw up there. Yeah, 63. Yes, 63, dude. That was really nice. Yeah, Lee's so good at staying full hops with the Nair. Yeah, Lee did a really good job of choosing his option to uh, block Taylor. Taylor decided to get out of the corner by trying to jump over him, and Lee just thought that was really good. Yeah. Yeah. We got an even match. Yeah. Even match. Taylor going over this time is successful. Ooh, that was a nice tech chase. Quick pivot wrap for the tech chase. But that's all he got off of it. Oh, we so got another dash attack, reverse pair. Wow. Good job opting for random. Oh, oh no! Yes, yeah. He was going a little too fast. I think he expected to grab the ledge, and then he didn't up the in time to get to the Yeah. Lee likes to play with Randall a little bit, though. Right. I've seen him laser camp on Randall. Full hop laser camping on Randall. I don't know how good an idea that is. <laughs> it's not a good idea, but it looks amazing when you do it. Ooh, two of smashes. Oh, Lee accidentally getting on the platform. Taylor gets back onto the stage. Nice ledge dash. We have some shield pressure, but Taylor rolls out. Oh my, oh my god. goodness, that was a little crazy. Was a but little he's still alive. A little bit too much of a call out. Oh, trying to shield drop, doesn't quite get it. Nice back air. Nice back air. Yeah, so Taylor's showing really good patience right here, you know, like yeah. he's like waiting for the packs and such. It's really nice. Yeah, we can only see Lee right now. Why? <laughs> there we go. Oh, it's oh nice. Yeah. nice job by Taylor once again. Lee going on to Randall once again. Alright, put your friendlies and start having your packet. <laughs> Station 10 is designated as a friendly oh, setup. Good nice back air. Alright. Good back air from Lee takes it. Twice Sneaking up underneath Taylor. One. Now see. I wouldn't be surprised. All on Raph Nap, station and I'm not trying to be biased or anything, but I wouldn't be surprised if Lee pulls this back to like a last, a last stock, last hit. Totally possible, but you know. Jay I've just seen Lee in this situation Miranda, so four. many times. That was a nice shield drop. Yeah. Oh, hey, that's Trigger, oh, that's Station five. Put him in a really good spot. Oh, fire! Station six. I caught him jumping or something like that. And I was talking with Quinn about this, and I think. This is like a thousand example of a good situation that like where Taylor tries. It's like a lot of the punishes aren't necessarily, you know, they aren't like guaranteed flow chart. Mm -hmm. But he's really good at capitalizing on situations where he's slightly advantaged, and then he can pressure you into just doing like something a little weird that he'll get you for it. Right. No, I agree. I think Taylor is definitely uh, in my experience, like when he plays from a lead, I feel like that's when he's the most comfortable. I mean obviously. Right. You know, when you play from a lead you're comfortable, but you know, so we on, the, on the flip side, it. yeah, on the flip side, I think like if he if he takes an early deficit, it's really hard for him to work back. Right. And uh, you know, he kind of has that attitude when he talks about things sometimes. Well, he's like, oh, yeah, you know, why did I win two games when I was down 2-0 well and just lose game five? I should have bothered with that. Yeah, right. So Lee, Classic. So we going to FD. Always been Lee's stage. True. He counterpicked me here, and you know, you saw that. Yeah. It was, it was close. I don't know if I would counterpick here unless I had. You know, the chain grab's really unlocked. Right. But this right is just now. like this is the old school counter pick stage, I feel like. Yep. If you wanna if you wanna really outplay someone, go to FD. Right now Taylor's the one who's up a bit. Yep. He's actually up by almost a whole stock, but oh, we got a little stuttering on the screen. Okay. <laughs> nice little hop there. Okay. Oh he misses the tech. Doesn't die. Ooh, good guy. Good guy. Good guy. Tried to stall. Yeah, he was trying to stall so he could get that bear up. You know the crazy thing about that? All he had to do was just get up from the ledge. Yeah. yeah. And he would have taken the stall. Sometimes I feel like that shine stall for a bear is like just a really swaggy but not that good option. It's a good option when they're rise when they're doing like a rising up. Oh yeah? Where they could you know They could ride they the wall a, or they could they could ride the wall, they could go straight up, or they could do like, you know, the mangle over. Right, right. They can like do like a mul multiple angles. That's when the back air is good from the ledge. Right, because it stays out and then you can cover a lot of things. Exactly. 
It's like covering the whole side of the stage very fast. Right there, Lemus is attack and Taylor capitalizes, reacting really quickly. Oh shit, I need an update. Oh, Taylor's not Yeah. I forgot, game one went by so quickly. Really nice shine there by Lee. Taylor goes for Mangle, but Lee is not dissuaded. Taylor hates shine spikes. I know this for a fact. <laughs> oh, I don't Suspect know. Suspect side me. I guess Almost he tried to shine. supposed to be a double shine. Oh, uh, third one? Oh, I got, I got hit by that same combo. Leo smashes. Lee probably likes it. Oh. Nice. Drops off with the near and gets the quick shine spike, calling out Lee's ride the wall. <laughs> Taylor said, yeah, I got those. Oh, that's not for Taylor, box. though. He was throwing out a lot of hitboxes when he was oh, in the man. Tries to wave dash back. Hesties. Taylor gets caught with that side B onto the stage a lot. Yeah. And I feel like that's kind of one of those, like, only once per game right. sort of recovery options. Because if you do it too much, then people start, you know, they start calling you out for doing it. Exactly. Oh, man. Leave this in that dash back right there. Oh, he missed that tech as well. Hard spot. Oh, but he sweet spot. See, all he had to do was roll up the stage. And Lee would have been, you know, dead. This would have been game three. But instead he back aired as he was, like, coming out. And now it's pretty tight. Both players are just, like, going for, like, these, like, really safe aerials. That's not going to do it just yet. But he does have the position of the Just totally, you know, like... Oh. In the sandbox right now. Oh, oh my god, goodness. It's a shine. Really great tech on the shine. Hot there. I don't know if I agree. Oh my god. He's like the trying to anti it. Oh. Alright. I think crazy. that's what that's what Lee was looking for with that last bear. Yeah, yeah. Alright. Hmm. Right. Wow, that was hype. 1-1. One, one. That's pretty crazy. I wonder if Taylor's gonna switch into here. No. No. Nope. Oh, no, it looks, like he's, it looks like he's not, you know, he's kinda got his groove with Fox. Um, I mean, he won the first game, you know, so. Yeah, and that was a pretty convincing win, too. Right. He's probably feeling Fox right now. Yeah. Yeah. Makes sense. Ooh. Okay. Narrowly missing that shine spike. Yeah. So he's looking to save the league. So Getting creative. Taylor with a lot of small yeah. stuff. A lot good. of creative pressure. Yeah. Yeah. See, uh, just roll. Just roll it from the ledge. I know you want to hit him with the. But what if he went high? <laughs> oh, yes. oh that's, that's not what we want to see. see. I really, I really want to see Taylor, you know, hold it together. We're really looking pretty good here. Good for All you had to do is wave that back right there. So straight off, nice drop there. Avoiding. That straight up angle when they're in their position like that where they can't get back to the stage, all you have to do is wave that back around the edge. Right. But that's the trick, right? You might think that they're gonna go in a bit and then wanna do something about it. Yeah. A lot of the time you can react. Right there. That was a great tech. That was a really good tech, but oh He's going off right now, and Armada? the reason why is because Taylor got a little ambition with pressure, and then he ended up crossing the lock and putting himself in the corner, and then suddenly he didn't have room to move, and the lead just kind of dropped from there. Yeah, it seemed like he kind of panicked a little bit. He's kind of, he's just been riding that moment. So. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, nice shot by Lee just jumping out. Uh. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, so 2-1 lead. Huh? Where will go? Uh, is he not in here? Alright, so Marth comes out. So Marth comes out on fountain. Probably. He's parked like, he's parked like on the far side. Honestly, I'm kind of wondering yeah. what happened. Taylor was looking pretty crispy like the first two games. But game. then, last game, he just dropped so much stuff. But Marth comes out on fountain, and we'll see if he can uh, yep. do something here. There's one way to get Taylor to switch to Marth. It was that last match. Yeah. And to be fair, Taylor usually does pretty well with the Marth. So. Oh, yeah. He's a, he, I would definitely say he's a Marth specialist. His fox pretty good, but I give it I give it to his Marth. Nice, this is my crispy edge guarding there by Taylor, but oh Man. no, why does I say that? Man. Nice time. Nice that was real nice. Be. Yeah, that was real nice. Neutral B wins games. Nice and easy. Nice movement there by Taylor. Oh, no. oh. 
Lee wanted to angle super hard to avoid the, both the counter and the down air, but he was not able to do it and instead angled to his death. <laughs> now Taylor, up two stocks to one, and he's got... Oh, oh what a monster combo. The reverse getup attack with Marth, nice. That was nice, but Lee able to recover still. Yeah, yeah. Oh no, <laughs> Lee missed the attack. And these two guys are just like, they're just doing it to each other. Like, the first know, right? two games gave the indications like, every game's gonna be close. Yeah. But these two last two games, dude, <laughs> These last games have been blowouts. So it's like, nah, I gotta, I gotta do it to you. Sorry, right, but man. Okay. Done this a million times. Up air, back off. That was a really nice snare. Uh, that nair beats a lot of grounded options from Fox. So if you see that Fox is trying to go for running times and stuff, then you can do that. And he just that was crispy. That was a really quick game four. Just like game three was really quick. He got game five. Now we got game five. Seen this so, so many times. Yeah. Oh. Really? David was looking for you? But like, did you see him on your way in? Yeah, no. No, it's just so winter. Stadium. Winter, winter's fun. So you got stadium. Taylor, think about switching back the box to a stadium kind of pick, I think. Yeah. Yeah. And I think that's, that's a pretty good choice. But nowadays, you know, a lot of Marths, a lot of Marths like, like to go stage, to yeah. stadium. Yeah. But it's kind of like a low-key FD right. with low platforms. Which is nice for Marth. Exactly. And a lot of the times, uh, especially while the stage transforming, sometimes you sit underneath the platforms and it becomes a lot more difficult for Fox to approach you. Because right. he doesn't want to end up on the platform. Yeah. But Taylor definitely is someone who plays a lot more with you know, like the platforms close to the edge and stuff. And, you know, he did really well in FD with the slots, despite losing the game in the end. So, it's, you know, nothing's unreasonable here. Unless that he played, you know, oh, yeah. a random character. <laughs> Nice. Stay, Solid mix up. That's another one of those uh, very Fox infrequent mix ups that you can do. Seven. Scan your opponent's head a little bit. The ledge cancel side B. Yeah. I like that a lot actually because I don't know. I, I kind of have trouble getting out of the corner with Fox. And if you know that angle, kind of, you know, it can catch your opponent off guard. Right. A lot of times people are guarding the edge and then if they don't, it's really hard to purely react to. Right, basically. you have to be ready for it. Yeah. Same with the short. Like, there's no way to cover the short right. unless, the unless short you're expecting it. Really good. Okay. Nice back air. Yeah. By tail. Just, you know, good job. <laughs> you know, it just sounds so late. It's like, it's a good back air. No, I'm doing it like that on right. purpose. Right, like, but yeah, he was no. a well-spaced back air. It, he did a good job of fishing out what Lee wanted to do to get out of the corner there. And since he happened to be on the side of the windmill, Lee's options there, since the windmill was high, were actually diminished. It was harder for him to go over. So he had to just go into the back air, which, you know, which is why it was a nice back air. Ford smashes him off the stage to mix up. Nice up too. Oh, I don't know about that. The side B. No, no, uh, Taylor chose something. It looked like, I mean, it looked like he was going to get that bear, but he just kind of missed. Uh, I, I kind of thought for some reason that he could just kill him. Okay. okay. So Lee does the back air. Since it stays out so long, uh, it does a really good job of covering most of these slow get-up options. Oh, going straight up and getting an all smash out of it. Sakurai would be so proud right now. Oh, okay. So Lee did a nice hop skip over Taylor's head there to reverse the positions and earn himself a kill. A nice hop skip. Yep. But now, oh, Taylor goes up on top of the platform trying to catch Lee, uh, you know, like wave dash out of shield towards center stage. But Lee just ran underneath. Yeah. Misread. He misread Taylor's tech and that cost him a stock. Yeah. You don't always want to go for it at all. Right. Go for the read. Read. Especially whenever you have, sometimes you can choose options that just cover everything and often will also combo to a kill. Ooh, that can't have been on purpose. Oh, Taylor said I'm out of Whoops. Here. Those players slipping and sliding. Definitely got to feel like this situation favors the box on the right side of the game. Yeah. Right. But not that time. I guess. Yeah, neither player is that patient, they just want to murder each other. Taylor takes it. 